it's Thursday, October 5th, 2023, and we're back with the news. Uh, we had a lot of sporting events on campus yesterday. Let's get right into the, uh, the results. Let's start over with Isaac. Tell us how the football game went. Yesterday on Wednesday, we played good, our defense played good in offense, but we had a heartbreaking loss of 8-0. to 8-0 to zero against Smith, yes. Smith scored right off the bat, um, and it didn't look good for the Bobcats, but their defense really, really stepped up um, and held them to zero points the whole rest of the way. Um, so 8 to nothing, a defensive struggle, but the team is getting better every day. All right, pass it on. How do the basketball teams fare? Baker is on its fourth game win streak, and we're and we and we look to keep the streak alive against Bullen tonight at yeah. their home floor. Last night, Baker played a terrific game against Smith to keep our win streak alive. It was a game that took everyone on the team to come together on defense, and Gabby played her best game of the season. The final score was 25 to 16. Gabby. Beanick. Beanick with 16 points wow. and Maddie Odgers with 9 points. All right, so the 7th graders won, Beanick. beat Smith. Uh, hand it over for the 8th grade. Let's hear the 8th grade results. I think they won too. Following, following the 7th grade game, the 8th grade earned a hard-fought 23-10 to 10 victory of their own to complete the yes. Smith night out. Five fingers to make a fist was the mantra going into the game, and the elder Bobcats embodied, embodied it, playing with their urgency as a team, holding Smith to two points through four quarters. The Knights added a few late buckets in the morning moments of the game. Baker's ready for a business trip to Bowling Park for game number six in the, in the afternoon. Scoring for the Bobcats were Maddie McChester with 10 points, London Irby with seven, Priscilla Marco with four points, and Maddie Manila with two points. Hard, hard and Hustle Award goes to Priscilla Marco. All right, so great job. The girls won both games against Smith. And what's going on today after school? Okay, so today after school, there's girls basketball at Bolin. That's right, so they try to continue the streak uh, today after school at Bolin. So go girls. Oh, also I want to throw in for the sports yesterday, you can check it out. The Chia team was amazing. Uh, one of the biggest sideline Chia teams we've ever had, and they were right on. Coach Wigman and Coach Krebling had them uh, going great and cheering on the team. Uh, you see a few pictures here. All right, so go ahead. What else is happening today after school? Today after school, there's going to be quiz ball in room 204. All right, quiz bowl today after school. What else? Wait, is it your birthday today? Yes. Happy birthday to Joseph. Everybody happy wish him a happy birthday. birthday. And that's, what a good way to let everyone know it's your birthday. Wear a giant hat that says happy birthday. Yes. I mean, that is uh, that is brilliant. All right, tell us what's happening with uh, I Am Flag Football. I Am Flag Football um, practice will be postponed due to rain. Yes, it's supposed to, the forecast is really bad today. It's supposed to rain all um, through three o'clock. So we will push that back until next week. Um, but there is practice tomorrow, right after school, 3 to 5. So, I am flag football players. Make sure you get a ride home or take the bus after school. Yes, and there is also Drama Club today, which is after school in room 116. All right, Drama Club after school today. And one more announcement. What do we have in the National Club? Pass it over there. We have International Club on Monday the 9th at 3 o'clock. Yes, next Monday the, the second international club will meet. And if you didn't go to the first one and you're still interested in helping out, um, talk to Miss Burt. So that's um, that's another opportunity. All right, did we miss anything, team? No, nope, no. Nope. You know what today is? Today nope. is Thursday, so it's Throwback Thursday. Uh, we're going to end with an old school video um, from Baker's uh, Video Tech uh, YouTube page. Uh, hopefully it won't be as cringy as the one from last week. That was really cringy. Did you see that? The apples and bananas? That was uh, one of the cringiest videos ever. But so cringy that it was funny. Um, so so yes, we'll do a better one today, um, and we will see you tomorrow on Friday. Goodbye! Bye. You alright? I'm alright. I'm quite alright, now my iPad's right. Uh, yeah. Penalties in life, I respect and care now. Hey, yeah. Penalties in life, I respect and care now. I don't really care, use your iPad On the real just don't miss, use your iPad Should've saw the way that she looked at that iPad She said, baby, I do not care Charger, yeah Push her to the office, now her iPad's dead Push her to the office, just charge her iPad Then you can't afford it, yeah Don't miss use iPads, don't miss use iPads iPad cover black, it's not all white There's something you used to do, like everything is cool Using it for math Using it for science now Everybody grabs in my head now Treat it with respect now Sticking your iPad in your backpack That is something that you should not do Every time that your screen get cracked Your parents be like, what did you do? First time your cracker replaces the screen The second and third you be charged with Billy's always saying down Three another third time, yeah Hey, think about your parents 
please Spending all their money On your clumsy actions You should feel a little less defeat Your parents keep spending cash And their pockets will be empty Yeah Hey guys, Bobcat's here now Time to teach you some iPad respect and can now This iPad's a piece of brand new technologies So use it well please Once you have learned to respect your iPad you will see that A successful student it is going to help you be that She said, I have learned, I have learned Thank you little Bob, get the iPad I have earned Don't misuse iPads, don't misuse iPads